Uh, I am excited for those of you that don't already have an OG 7300 because that means the prices are coming down on those for the used market. And it's a hell of a radio uh, if you're a starter in this hobby. Uh, even if you're a couple years into it and you don't have one with a big screen yet. 300s, I saw one listed on QRZ this weekend for 650 bucks in mint shape. A guy claimed that hadn't been used much. I think we're going to keep seeing those prices come down uh, with the release of the Mark III. You always find that when these fancy new radios uh, get announced uh, that the people that have the predecessor to it uh, will do the quick dump because they don't want to get stuck ha- holding the bag. So if you are looking for a radio, can't go wrong with the 7300, and there's going to be a plenty of them out there because, uh, like I say, one of the best-selling HF radios that we're aware of on the market. So I think they're, that's cool, uh, right? Thinking, thinking a little outside, right? Uh, if you're you're not right into the Mark II, uh, which we I would expect is going to be somewhere in the twelve ninety nine range. There you go. There's another uh, N eight JRD predi- prediction right out of the gate. Probably twelve ninety nine. Calculation mode. There we go. Yeah. Uh, but I am very very excited for those folks that that haven't picked up a seventy three hundred yet. Those those are going to come down in price, and and you're going to have the the rush uh, to the new one. There, uh, it's very exciting. I also really like that the fact that it's a Type C with the dual com and audio ports. So you basically and get two virtual com ports in, in unison that work separately. 